Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn HTML by building a cat photo app. Step 23. All right. So the figure element represents self-contained content and will allow us to associate an image with a caption. All right. So we're going to nest the image we just added with a figure element. All right. So we're going to come over here and we're going to check out the uh, figure element. So figure element HTML right there. We'll come down here. And uh, let's look at the example first. So we're gonna use a figure element, to, pardon me, a fig, yeah, a figure element to mark up a photo in a document and a fig caption element to define a caption for the photo. So when we try it ourselves, we see this uh, line of houses in Italy and we see that it's got the figure surrounding, pardon me, the figure surrounding the image and the fig caption that we haven't gone over yet, right? So basically it seems like the section, but for a uh, for an image, right? So let's look at the definition and usage. So the figure tag specifies self-contained content like illustrations, diagrams, photos, code listings, etc. So while the content of the figure element is related to the main flow, its position is independent of the main flow. And if removed, it should not affect the flow of the document, right? And uh, here's the tip, the fig caption element you use to, cap to add a, a caption for the figure element, right? So basically, like I said in here, it's just like a uh, section, but for an image, right? So let's uh, see if there's anything else. Not really, all right? So let's come over here and we're going to wrap this thing up in the figure element. So we'll come over here and say, ah, uh, opening figure, figure, and then down here, we'll do a closing figure. Close figure, 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 like that, right? And just like with the section right here, uh, it does pretty much nothing, but it's, it, it does separate the thing. So that's uh, good for us. Let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 24. And we'll see you next time.